हेलो फ्रेंड दिस इज मैनाग फ्रॉम सिविल सेंटर एंड आई वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू बैक टू आर सेकेंड एपिसोड ऑफ जी प्लस सिक्स बिल्डिंग डिजाइन यूजिंग टेकला स्ट्रक्चरल डिजाइनर सो फ्रेंड्स बेसिकली इन दिस वीडियो विल शो यू देंट्रल लाइन डायग्राम ऑफ दिस प्लान विच इज दिस सो बिफोर मेकिंग द सेंट्रल लाइन डायग्राम वी नीड द बीम कॉलम प्लान एंड आफ्टर दैट वी कैन मेक आर सेंट्रल लाइन सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू नो हाउ टू असाइन द कॉलम पोजिशन एंड हाउ टू ड्रॉ द सेंट्रल लाइन डायग्राम can go to our description below we'll provide a link there on our video to how to assign column positions and how to draw center line diagrams we have an entire video series on that please go through that so basically as you can see for importing a file in tech like you can see all this center lines are in a separate layer as you can see here these are all in a separate layer so all these center lines need to be in a separate layer for importing in tecla structural designer then we can go to our save as option in our save as option we have the option of other formats here we can save it as as you can see we can save it as dxf so this dxf file is a file which can be imported to tecla structural designer so this is the process of importing the files and while making the center line diagram you need to assume where the location of the beams will be done we compare these two plans you can see this is the portion which combines the bedroom and also the toilet so at this entire portion a column has been given here another column here and one here and one here four columns are given here and beams are joined like this as you can see this portion and you can also see here this beam has not been given so we can provide a concealed beam during construction which is also known as hidden beam you can see here also these are the location of the columns and location of the beams which are given in the plan so basically we have left out some beams which are to be given as concealed beams and we have joined the remaining beams this is the beam and columns for the lift portion and here we have will have one staircase here we will have another staircase and these are the basically the four units so this is the center line diagram which is to be saved as dxf file for importing in tecla structural designer we need to make sure that all the center lines are in a particular layer so that we can import them as architectural grids in tecla structural designer which is the main advantage of the software that is we don't have to create grids we can import it from our cad file so friends how did you find this video please let us know in our comment section and if you have any queries or if you have any suggestions please let us know see you in the next video bye bye